Guys, I think this kitchen is possessed. What's up, Sauce and Spice family? If you're tuning in to our channel for the very first time, be ready to be true. And don't forget to hit that subscribe button and the little bell down below. I remain your girl OT. And I'm Luki. Wait, Luki, why are we wearing black today? Why, why Do you know I can just I can just you're, notice you're it? You're copying my Please, style. Please, no one died. <laughs> <laughs> no one died, though, that we know. Yeah, obviously. That we know. Um, do you know where I'm from? I do now, of course. Where in Edo? Awuchi. Ah, ah, where in Awuchi? Game over. Ha, ha, ha. So, guess. you guess, are you serious? Wow. Yeah, so I'm from Aochi, and in Aochi, I am from um, somewhere called Etako West. And in Etako West, I am part of a clan called South Ibie. It consists hmm. of five villages. And in the five villages, I have my village there, which is called Iereko. I know. I'm on my own, don't worry. I'll... You will give us a day, no problem. Um, so, what I want to do today is I want to prepare like the main, the main meal that we prepare in our village. Okay. So we use it in any occasion. Um, weddings, naming ceremony, even funerals, we use, it is an awesome meal. Okay. That I would love you to try. Sure. It's pounded yam and granite soup. Yeah? Pounded yam and granite soup. Like, like the granite that we eat. Yes, the granite that we eat. And that's what we have here. This here is really all that is needed okay. to prepare it. Uh -huh. So here we have pepper, paprika. I use paprika and onions. I know, right? My paprika. Shombo. <laughs> Don't forget. It's not shombo. It's paprika. <laughs> um, here I have stock fish and mm -hmm. um, locust beans. Mm -hmm. That's um, iru. Um, yeah, this is red oil. I will normally not use red oil, but I guess, you know, go to the root of this. So, okay, yeah, this is um, bitter leaf. Alright. The bitter leaf, how you do it is, when you have put everything in, you put the bitter leaf last. Okay. And you don't stir it immediately. You like Once you stir food? it, it will be bitter. It used to be bitter. Are you serious? Yes. So, you have to leave it in for about a minute before you stir. Okay. Yes. Like, is this like the normal bitter leaf, like even Igbo people they use? Yes. I agree. It. I this is actually fresh. I agree. It. Oh, yes, okay. Like, That's the reason why you um, when you put it in, you're not meant to stay immediately. Yeah, I don't. I, it is. I'm not really seeing how well. Because it's I, not really like we uh -huh. Igbo where we yes. pluck out the bitter leaf. We there's this thing we squeeze out the. Juice. juice the okay, yeah, I did juice. that, yes, but I didn't yeah. really like But you have to squeeze it out well. When you're not squeezing, then you cook. After you cook, you put, um, there's this thing they call a cow. I don't know what they call it in English. That's alum now. Alum. That's what they use for yeah, cleaning snail. Is that the one? No, nah, not that type of alum. I don't, I'm not okay. a snail person, so I don't know if it's, but what I know it as is a cow. Okay. It helps soften the bitter leaf. So okay. when you try to squeeze out the juice the second time, yeah, it's better. Okay. Yeah. No problem. Oh yeah, we have the ground nuts. So Can in I the ground nuts, yeah, sure, sure. In the ground nuts, we blended something with it, and I took a little of it to show you guys. Oh, sorry, that's what it's in there. Mm. It's called uzazi. I know I've heard of it before. Uh -uh. I've heard of uzazi. It grows mainly in West Africa. The English name is. Oh, can I remember the English name now? Mm. That's an English name. If I remember it, I'll let you know. This is really nice, guys. Yeah, so you blend it with it because you can't blend it separately. It's difficult for it to break oh, down. Oh, okay. Yes. Um, uh -huh. So one of the reasons why normally I put ginger and I put garlic in my mm -hmm. sauce, one reason why I didn't do that is because of this particular spice here. Mm -hmm. If I do that, it's going to reduce the flavor and the richness of this spice. Okay. Yeah. Because I'm talking, let me just start. So I'll start off by putting my um, stock fish and oh yeah, there's goat meat inside. The goat meat is cooked already. I'll start off by putting my stock fish in and my um, iru. 
I don't want to call it a low cost thing. So I'm trying to remember the. So, so you need to be very local this you know? time around. Yeah. Uh, so the oil is going to do its own work now. I'll leave it in there for a while. Oh yes, I need it. I need you to help me with something. Okay, sure. I want you to help me pound the yam. Okay. So that's the pounder. They just put it in there and pound it. Yeah. But locally, we have a mortar and piece to that we use. It. Do you know when I told her to make pound it? Yeah. She said, "Are we going to pound it?" And it's not the. Are we going to pound it? It's like. Are we going to pound it? I need to be sure. Yeah, sure, sure. Because they're telling me I'm. Pounded yam, so I'm mm -hmm. like, okay, maybe I'll go and change to something more suitable for. No problem, pounding. I have trousers and shirt. You want us to go and bring it? I have uh, this thing. Excellent. Um, so that is doing the stuff. I will add. Can you see how simple it is? Just simple. Just want to just be putting in everything one by one. So the ground nuts, okay. you actually have to prepare it that day. When I mean prepare that day, if you fry it that day, you okay. have to grind this that day and you have to cook it that day. So oh, if you okay. fry it and you don't blend it, what's mm -hmm. going to happen is when you now blend it, it's going to bring out a lot of oil. Okay, you don't need that oil. You don't need the oil. And if you fry it and you blend it mm -hmm. and you don't cook it that day, what's going to happen is it's not going to give you that thick granulty aroma. Okay. So you have to do everything that, that day. day. Yes. Um, I know it's, it's like all these things, they're just thoughts that we just came up with. That will show you how rich our village is. Wouldn't that be awesome if we have like a TV series that's centered around the history of our village? I don't think it would be that interesting. What's the definition of an interesting TV series? Let me catch you now. Ah, okay, now you caught me because I don't have any definition. I'll go with the genre. Okay, so what's your yeah. genre? Um, I love comedy, sci-fi, fantasy, yeah maybe you say fantasy yeah what kind of fantasy fantasy when it comes to um vampire werewolves and all this it's I'm, sure, I'm, I'm sure i'm sure your 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 definition of um vampire werewolves is twilight uh, it's no, not you don't like twilight no no what no i like like hardcore vampire like like what when, dracula. when vampires they don't have you seen dracula? In the sun they burn have you seen dracula of course dracula is like Okay. The main, the father of all vampire movies. <laughs> I'm done. Okay, so so your TV series. Tell me one that you have watched that is like one of your best. Not your best, though. Okay, I want. To I want you to think about your best. And I think about your best. Tell me about one of your best. Oh uh, wow! Okay, yes. Gossip Girl. I could. The reason why I said Gossip Girl is because it's one series that I could sit back with my girls and we just just a laugh. Exo Exo Gossip Girl. I think back then when it was released, I was still. I, I have no idea what Exo Exo. That's what they girl. always say, Gossip Girl. <laughs> um, I think I was still in second high school. Yeah, I was still in high school when um Gossip Girl was released. So, like, now I can still sit back and just watch it and be like, even though I know what is going to happen next. I'm is like, it still on or it's no, ended? No, it's, it's, it has ended already. Oh. It's ended. Guys, I think this kitchen is possessed. <laughs> Are you afraid? <laughs> this drawer always opens up by itself. If I close it now, eh? as I'm having this conversation, the possibility is going to open up again. Wow. Okay, okay so you have told us Gossip Girl. What else? You, are, you know you mentioned fantasy, so give me a fantasy oh. TV series. Please don't, apart from, <laughs> what's a, apart from Vampire Diaries. Oh, no, 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 no. I like originals. <laughs> apart from Vampire Diaries and originals. Okay, Siren. Siren. I've never heard of that before. You should check it out, it's a nice one. What's it about? It's, it's about mermaids. Well, I've watched plenty of series. Was okay. my all-time favorite till now. And I, if, if I say it, I can almost bet you have never heard of it before. What's that? Fringe. I was about to taste this, but I just have to put my. What? This is what? Have you heard of it? What's fringe? Ha! Fringe is one of, if not. Very nice. It's nice. Don't stay it. No, I'm taking it from the side. Ah, I thought you were about to no. stay it. 
<laughs> that's, how just, that's, that's how I was just going to start all the way from the beginning. Do not think that I have been preparing the thing since. Um, so the food is ready. I was talking about fringe, yeah? It's about science, like mother science. It has to do with parallel universes, dimensions, few. I'm listening now, okay? Was I just going to the food? Oh, God. No. Don't call it lost in your veins. So I should continue, Abby. Yeah, continue. I should continue talking about yeah, the fringe. Sure. Okay. So it's centered around like three. Your eye look again. No, you said it's centered around three. Let's try the food. Yeah? And let's see how it is. So we have pounded yam, granite soup with goat meat. Mm. You want to go first? Well, this strong. Before I go in or dig into this meal, you all don't forget to leave a comment down below on your favorite TV series. So watch me as I dig in. I mean, popular girl. For me, I like using my hands. Mm. This came out beautifully well. Mm -hmm. Don't forget to give us a thumbs up, share, and be sure to subscribe. Why are you licking your fingers? Bye, guys. Mm -hmm.